What is going on everyone? Welcome back to another video here on the Hashtag United channel. And no, I'm not in the middle of a pitch. I mean Hashtag Head quarters me and Wes are here and I think the time is now currently half 11 we will be setting off in around about 15 minutes for our first home league game on a Saturday exciting stuff but we're going up against Wivenhoe which Wes has actually gone to watch you've seen them play before haven't you yeah I saw them play Braintree Braintree reserves uh, Braintree won and Wivenhoe definitely looked beatable so come on the lads three points incoming so as you've just heard from the white cante we have a bit of knowledge and I think we drew a win guys but let's not waste any time, let's go. And we are all stuck in traffic. I'm in the car with Baz, Dead. Jans, Don't Wes. Wes, take the camera now. I'm, I'm having to move forward, but I'm Sorry, man, I'm just watching Theo Baker's latest video. Just don't be like this, Wes. <laughs> but yeah, we're stuck in traffic. It's not ideal, but we're banging the tunes and we're getting pumped for today, aren't we? Get pumped for oh, that's, that's, like that's not the most that's not the least pumped. <laughs> That's like the most least pumped Joe, reaction ever. We're Pain. not even moving. I, mean, I know, but we're banging the trains and we're getting pumped. Even though we're stuck in traffic, we're still trying to do everything in our power to get pumped for this game. All I'm thinking about, I'm going to get a fine. <laughs> oh, wow. That's what I'm thinking. Oh, yes, wow. we're going to get a fine. No, because we leave quite early anyway. So we should still be there before anyone else. Yeah, true. Fingers crossed. Fingers, Fingers crossed. crossed. Otherwise, everyone's getting a fine. <laughs> Update. An hour has gone by and we haven't moved anywhere. I think we've probably moved only like two miles. How much is the happy. fine if you're late? Two pound, no, one pound, two one pound. pound. Two Blue pound. Get sacked though. Hang on, you're in the same boat as me, so you might be as well. Oh, yeah. Wow. A bit camera shy. Oh, yeah. You're gonna shout for me today? No, no, you're gonna keep it down today. <laughs> How are you though? I miss you. <laughs> 50,000, no, my head at this. What? Oh, here we go again. Wait, wait, hang on, I'm gonna stop coming up to you with the camera if you keep moaning every time oh, I come to you. So I don't like it. Baller. Hang on, wait, sorry, he's got his own Baller. channel and apparently his camera's shy. I think we should get, he's gonna be a fan favourite. Hang, hang on, hang on. Wait, wait, wait. these two. Oh, he is. No, we, we've already uh, done a recent video called Hashtag Teammates of You, which you made your uh, debut sitting down. Hashtag Teammates. Yeah. Did you enjoy it? I did, it was fun. Ricky didn't, I don't know. No. Hold on, let's oh, get Oh, he's he not camera, <laughs> look, the second the camera <laughs> gets here, he's gonna get panicky. <laughs> no, hashtag teammates, fun, <laughs> wasn't it? On his relationship. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's not, hey, look, you can't say anything when he's around, he's a wind up. Tattoos, and you said you were gonna get the first one, probably about a year ago, yeah. year later, you haven't got it. Well, it's because I scored. Go. <laughs> it was if I didn't Go. score. Oh. In the Scott four Willard. games. Scott oh, Scott, oh my yeah. God. Scott Willard that's, that's has said that he that's wants it, doesn't he? Like over a thousand yeah, didn't he only ask for like oh. 100 or 200? 500. No, he asked for 500, oh, yeah, and it got like over a thousand. So, hashtag Academy's best finisher has to be going on some Surely part of his body. No, 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 what? No, we don't do none of that. Look, he can put on his foot right at the bottom. Hashtag Academy's best finisher. He's got a big enough foot. Where you get it? Small text. Small text. Hang on. Is that. That's tech as guru. Tech as guru, mate. How are we? I'm in an environment I'm not used to being. I'm on the sideline, mate. Yeah. Still out. Still out, unfortunately, but um, had some good news from Stevie. Okay. Hopefully, roaming for next week. Nice. If selected. But um, but you're playing a very important role today, though, aren't massive you? Massive role today, mate. It's yeah. Probably the most important role you've ever, ever had, right? All I'm saying is, the boys better not slip up because listen, you're commentary. gonna dig them out. Come yeah. on. <laughs> anyway, you are on commentary today. Yeah. If people don't know already. Yeah. You've had Man's Dog, yeah, you've I had heard, heard Wes, I watched and now you got Tekkers. Ninety minutes, by the way. And, wow. Um, he was a natural. He, was he is good, natural. isn't he? So I've got I've got some big, big shoes to fill, but um, I'm looking to give some good technical. Tekkers okay, nice, on the game. nice. Uh, so then, so less jokes, more technical. Listen, there's got to be jokes there, no? Because you know, it's just light-hearted. But I'm definitely going to speak about, I guess. How we play as a unit, okay. how we defend, how the other team plays. But the main thing is we're looking for three points. Today. We are. It's a big, big game. I think all the boys are, all the boys are up for it. Good training session. I was yep. there in the week watching. Everyone looks sharp. So I've got, I've got a good feeling about today. So let's just hope we get three points. Hold on. Jackie H in his training gear. You're back. You're fit. I'm fit. And you're ready to I'm play. Ready to go. You missed two games. Is that right? Yeah, two games. Two games then came off when we were drawing our other games. So. What are they? And then Nemesis as well, aren't they? Yeah. Nemesis. Try out the new boots. Hopefully, get me a goal. 
free kick today, that's what I'm saying, free kick. What, on a set piece? Nice. Obviously, Tekka's guru is usually on them, so you, you need to take this time. You need to step up and bag a goal, mate. I'm top bins, mate, that's where it's going, I'm telling you. <laughs> Onto whose head? Stampy's head, or are you just going to go straight for goal? Straight for goal, mate. Well, it depends where it is. If it's on the yeah. obviously I look for the big man. Yeah. But I'm You're on corners as well? Yeah, Nice. Are you, you a clipper or are you a whipper? No, I'm a whipper, mate. Whipper. You got to whip them. You got to have some power on them. Fair play. I look forward to seeing them. Richo, you fancy a goal today? Hope so, mate. More than anything, three points. No, no, yeah, all, yeah. Well, it's nice true. to That's score, true. obviously, but three points. I'm a team player. Three points, but I am due one, and I probably should have had one last week. <laughs> you should have. You should have. He played well, though. He did. He did. But no excuses. Hopefully, I'm looking to. You. So, what have you scored already? So, have, you, have you scored a header? Or not? Yeah, pre season. Yeah, can't well, them, yeah, we can't do that. Because I'm thinking, five games in at least, you need to score left foot, right foot, and a header. That's my Including goal to you. Pre-season goal. Including, well, I'll, I'll give you the pre-season one. Oh, let me have, I'm not counting. That's my aim to you. My audio, uh, me and the audience is aim to you. Yeah, okay. We'll go for it. Jacko, having a stretch out before the game. So, a lot of people may or may not have already caught on, but um, you and Andy are doing alternate games, aren't you? We are. We are for the time being. I think we've got a. Uh, We've got a rotor set at the moment, but uh, yeah. Devs has obviously said, look, to both of us, if uh, if one struggles, if there's a dip in form, then obviously it will go that way. Wow. But as it stands, and I think it's been an issue thus far, um, and obviously we both got we both got quite young families, mm. so um, it's hard to commit week in week out yeah. with the travelling and uh, being in the league now. Um, the, the hashtag of old kind of suited suited us both where it's sporadic games were all over the place and uh, we had a bit of time off but obviously with this a rotor has suited us both quite well as it stands but yeah as I say Dev said we'll see how it goes and if it, it would suit the team more then we'll um, one will take the other's place and vice versa so if I was Devs that's that's something that that, that would consider me dropping you or not what do you think of it LP? I think it is Weird, mate. Weird. I mean, I've always wanted white, white hair or like Weird. silvery hair, but I think you've got to be of a certain age, and I think you're, uh, you're a bit past it. A lot of people said that the scariest man in football tag is weakened. It's gone. By the, by the it's bar. in the past, mate. Listen, it'll be back. It won't be long before uh, I decide to get bored of this, and it'll be uh, it'll be a number one all over skinhead again. I feel like you need like a tattoo on your face to even I'm keep tempted. that there. Yeah. Yeah. Something. Maybe don't a hash. Have tattoos, kids. Yeah. Be different. Don't have a tattoo. I mean, I mean, you've got them all going on in your arm, and if you want to maintain the scariest man football, I reckon you need something just, 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 just around here somewhere. Like what? Mm. How about your maybe a hashtag? Your face. <laughs> oh yeah, imagine my LP. face on your face. LP on Jacko's cheek. Wow. That, well, you wouldn't be scary then. You'd be unbelievable. <laughs> LP no, is here to expose some people. <laughs> Show me what you've got. Who is it? Hit me with a Megs, please, sir. I'll try. No Megs as of yet. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> That's okay, is that? <laughs> right, so I don't think we actually got that, but uh, the captain's been injured, a ball to the skull. Hang on, hang on. What happened there? No, my teammate, he's trying to go for my spot, look at him. Is that Harry Honesty? He was Triple H. Geezer's a joke. Geezer is a joke. He's killed him. Oh, that's our captain, mate. <laughs> We can only have about eight seconds of this song because of copyright. And this is Mikey. A lot of you guys might not know. This is Mike, our uh, kit man, hard at work. How are we? I'm good, mate. How are you? Very good, thank you. It's nice to uh, hopefully get you onto the vlogs now because uh, how do we know you? You can explain to everybody how you've come um, about working here. Uh, my son is a massive hashtag fan and he said, why don't you apply? So I applied yeah. and here we are now. Legend. Absolutely legend. And uh, your son has come to a few of the games though, hasn't he? Yes, he has come he has, to a yeah. few. He's here that as well, yeah. Yeah, so he, I remember speaking to him and he was like, who's your favourite player? And he, his favourite player was Ryan Adams. Mm. So, uh, yes. so I'm guessing you might be having hashtag play a lot on the TV or on the laptops around the house. All over the place. Wherever <laughs> you go, hashtag. Hashtag. Faz. Talk to him about his stretch. Proper stretch. stretching it out, mate. Basically. Called it's, it's, well, it's just called the groin, yeah, still. Yeah, I'm getting the groin nice and loose for, you know, might be an impact sub, I'm hoping. Look at this guy's moves. Ellis, what's he? Ooh. Bang, bang. <laughs> Way! <Whee! That> was... <laughs> it's a rotor glass man, is it? Oh, here we go. I only got two Hang on. Ain't that like a year ago that happened? <laughs> I can't this goes up, because you're such a slow editor. Hang on. 
Ooh. Boom. That's not true. Anyway, back to using these bad boys again. Just call me Guru Tyler. The thing is, what's great about having TS Guru, aka Tinker's Guru, aka you say nicer, aka 17,000 names, um, is that he actually is a proper coach as well as a player, so he can give proper technical analysis. And you can't. I'm just like, he's passed it. He's scored a goal. <laughs> and he can be like, he actually you see it on the back foot. Check this shoulder. Driven pass through the middle, and he finessed it into the top corner. What a goal! So much info. You know, I reckon you'll be still pretty static, but you'll still manage to drop a shoulder even though you're sitting there. I'm always dropping shoulders, mate. <laughs> Look, Thank God. <laughs> We've been so close. We've been so close. And we are getting there. And it will come. We're going to get those three points on the board sooner rather than later. But if we don't, I don't want anybody in this room to feel any kind of pressure about getting those, that, that, that victory. There's no pressure anywhere within this room. The only place that there is pressure is on me. And that's exactly how I want it to be. That's exactly how it should be. And I do feel that what we've been doing, we've been starting really well, and then when the goal hasn't come, frustration setting in too early. Be the better side. If you're the better side, just stay being the better side and it will come. It's as simple as that. Yes, we've got to be a bit better, I think, in the final third. Yes, we've got to be a bit better in the defensive third. But we're not far away. Concentration levels at the back, in particular, I'm looking today when we're attacking. That's what's been our undoing. We've conceded goals from our own attacks. And that is just an organisational um, and communication and a concentration thing. We've got Tom back in the side today. Jack comes back in as well. We get, we've got a little bit of experience coming back in. All right? That's going to help the likes of you, Marcus, and you, Kane, in terms of the check. But you've got to take responsibility as well. I want you to enjoy your football. I want you to enjoy today. I want you to go out there and in possession, express yourself out of possession. Work your damned hardest to ensure that they get nothing out of us. Yeah, let's go, come on. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Hashtag United's first Saturday home game of the season here in the Eastern Senior League. My name's Spencer. Today, we are taking on Wivenhoe Town and I'm joined by the one, the only, Mr. Tekkers Guru on the commentary. Welcome, Tekkers. Hello, Spencer. Thank you for having me on here. It's a pleasure, absolute pleasure. I'm looking forward to hearing some insightful analysis from you throughout the game. The reason Tekkers is here, of course, is because he's currently injured. We'll talk more about that later on. Let's start things off, though, by taking a look at the lineup for Hashtag United today. In goal, we have the scariest man in football, Jacko. In defence, welcome back to Tom Williams, his first game of the season proper. He's been away uh, on holiday, but he's back starting at left back. In, in the centre back, we also have Jack Harrison. The captain is back from injury. This could be huge for Hashtag. Next to him is Marcus Stamp. And at right back, it's the second game in a row for the loanee from Tilbury, Kane Brogham. Uh, in midfield, we have Ricky Evans and Matt Carter in centre mid. Just ahead of them, we've got Harry Honesty on the left, Ryan Adams behind the striker, and a first start of the season for Charlie Morley on the right, leaving Neil Richo Richmond up front. And we are underway, kicked off by Ricky Evans, who plays it to Matt Carter and sends it towards Ryan Adams. Straight away, chance for Harry Honesty. As the ball bounces from in the box, headed away by the centre-back for Wivenhoe, and it's going to be an early corner for Hashtag. Now, you'd, you'd probably be taking this corner if you were playing Tekkers. I think it's going to be uh, Matt Carter who takes it on the right foot. What sort of delivery are you looking for? Well, I'm, I'm confident in Matt Carter's delivery. Um, he's obviously come from a step above as well. He's got he's got good techers, as you say. I'm looking for a whipped in just between the six-yard line for uh, the big boys to attack. Here it comes in, then. It's going towards the back stick. Chance for Jack Harrison, who heads it towards goal. And it's cleared again by that number five, who's the man that actually sent it off for the corner. Lee Branson there for Wivenhoe. <laughs> what a return that would have been for Jack. Another corner from the other side. Now it's going to be a left foot. It's going to be Tom Williams whipping it in on that experienced left boot. There is the ball. This one's not. It's one. Oh, oh the front post and it's headed on target but cleared off the Second line goals. by the Wivenhoe defender. And Ricky Evans has tried an overhead kick. And what a start by Hashtag. Set pieces and corners particularly looking lively. And maybe we should be 1-0 up, Techers. This is the ideal position in order to you know what we want to see from Matt now is to get a little bit of pace and dip on it and just trust that the players running across get a touch on it there's the ball from that's Matt good. Carter that's good no, it's good it's actually a defender I think that got the last touch okay so goalkeeper for Wivenhoe Town sends it 
high, but uh, towards his number eight in the middle, who eventually gets it away from Charlie Morley and Ricky Evans. Puts the ball over the wing to this lad who looks quite fast. He's got someone in the middle as he tries to find him. Jack needs to head away. Well play, Jack. And Jack does head away indeed. I know it's the right foot angle, but would you shoot on this, Tekkers? It's one of them areas which I would literally, uh, it's, it's a cross shot. You get as much on it as you can and you trust your players to run across it. It could bounce and go into the far post. He's not done badly there, to be fair. Jacko punches it away from danger and it was important he did that. Got it away from uh, the That's box. Offside. That's offside. That was actually a good that, ball. It was, it was offside. I, I could see that. The line, the line done very well there. These are the sorts of things that we need to get within our game. To squeeze up high and deny the space in behind. Um, Defence done really well there. He said he needs to add to his finishing. I think now when we've got this facility and we're training on a weekly basis. Number 11's turned his man here. Gets a shot off on the left foot. Great Big save, save from Jamie Jackson. Came out of nothing. They were calling for a free kick after a strong Jack Harrison tackle. It wasn't given, but it seemed like the calls of ref distracted the players. And Wivenho went through. And it was Aaron Donaldson who hit the shot on the left foot. And Jacko equal to it. Richo comes with experience, doesn't he? And uh, and as he's as he's getting older, obviously he's getting more knowledgeable and wiser on his decision making. He's not going to be able to run the channels all day long. So Ryan's a willing runner, and he's got that in his legs. Richo's plenty capable enough to get on the half turn and bring others in. So it's it's working well. I just want to see a little bit more quality in that final third. The ball's running through at the moment. Charlie Morley doing well there to win a free kick for hashtag. You talked about Charlie. You want to, you want to see him keeping wide and one of the strengths in Charlie's games is a very versatile player both footed so you can play him on the left on the right down the middle yeah. even up front yeah. um, it's important though when you do get moved around a lot to know how to play each position right and, and where you've got to be and where you've got to be spatially roles and responsibilities are massive he's still young I mean as long as he's willing to learn and ask questions to the likes of devs or any other senior members of the team they'll, they'll help him and I'm sure he'll be able to, to grasp it Tom Williams with the Second ball in ball. here falls to Jack Harrison yes! he's on the left foot and it's Captain Jack who returns to the first team with a goal on the left foot. He's back. He's Jack. He's the captain. And it's 1-0 to Hashtag. Tremendous finish by Jack. He's almost let the pace of the ball come towards him. And all he's done is guide it with the outside of his boot. The keeper had no chance. He saw it late. And uh, the Hashtag hopeful will be hoping this continues. I'm sure the fans watching at home and here in the stadium will want to see more goals. But I know for a fact Devs would take a 1-0. He'd love a clean sheet. Ryan Adams, though, beats his man, pulls it back to Matt Carter. Oh, and he's tackled with a decent tackle from the Wivenhoe defender. Ricky Evans, though, gets there. And the hashtag have kept this alive very well indeed. It was almost too good of a ball, Spencer. It was right under Matt's feet. I mean, it, it would have been nice just in front of him. He could have, he could have come late and, play, um, and placed it in. Lee Branson there playing the ball across. Well read, Charlie. Gone to Charlie Morley, and Lee's out of position now. And he's tried to make a recovery tackle, and he's still out of position. Their centre-back's way, way out of, out of position. But uh, number six there, David Darbin with the tackle. And that's a good ball through. Tom Williams needs to get something on this. Stand Connor Jones Stand trying Tom. to get a chance. Hits it on the turn. That was always really difficult to get the purchase on it. He needed to beat Jacko. I think that was good, good recovery from Tom. He used his experience again. He just stood up. He, he forced the player to curl it around him. And it was a weak shot, to be honest. Kane there gets a good touch on the ball from right back. Sends it long towards Richo. If he can take it down, it's a good touch. Hits it on the right foot. And what a goal that would have been. Absolutely tremendous touch. Almost Dennis Burkham-esque. Um, just needed to lift it a little bit higher over the goalkeeper because the goalkeeper was off his line. But number 10's got a chance here. Stamp needs to come and he wins the 50-50 tackle and we love that from Marcus Stamp. Ricky Evans on the ball with a man on. Needs a call. Tries to play it into Richard but it goes to Ryan Adams well done, Ryan. whose touch takes him away from the number four. Ryan Adams on the left side now. Is he going to whip it in? Tries to get on his right foot instead. Finds Harry Honesty on the edge of the box. Who hits it? Straight at the keeper. The crowd were already standing in anticipation. There it is. That's the half-time whistle. 1-0 to Hashtag United, who take the lead into the break. I think they're deserving it. I think they've been on top, not taking all their chances, but um, promising so far. Over to Devs. If I was them, I'd be delighted. Absolutely delighted to still be in the game. That's, that's all. Just because you've been so good. You've been so good. Set-piece deliveries have been tremendous. We've attacked. We've had chances. They're just going big, aren't they? They're just going big. We've got to defend more aggressively. When we've gone at them in the final third, all they've, all they've been able to do to stop us is, is give free kicks away. Could we be a bit more precise with our passing? Maybe, but I think it'll come. I would rather people try and slide people in and it go out of play than us not have any kind of purpose about our passing and maybe be tentative and not confident. So I can accept that. I can accept it when you slide and it's just not quite right. You've tried to play a couple in, you've tried to slide a couple in. I can accept that. 
that will come. It's the when the ball breaks down and we all get, it's all a bit too slow. We're too slow to recover in, to bank up. When we're defending, Right, we go that and we're a four and we're a two and we're when we defend we've got to become at least a four or a five at least a four or a five to protect because your pace and your pace allows us to transition from defense to attack and from a five or a four to a three like that and that's what alert teams i think we're too too often in that first pass we're looking to transfer defence into attack, like we're just going to go bang, yeah, it's all going to open up. Hmm? Secure possession first. Work hard, know we've got a threat. Thank Join God. in. Go again. And we're underway here for the second half as the ref kicks things off at Coles Park. 1-0 to hashtag currently, and it's Withenhoe with the ball. Quick correction from the first half commentary. I actually said it was Wivenhoe fans with the drums, but it's actually hashtag fans with the drums. It's a lad called Will, who's now standing behind the goal hashtag of shooting into the Wivenhoe goal. And uh, yeah, you can see him there, or well, we can see him anyway with the drums. So his name's Will, he's a hashtag fan, and he's a drummer, and we welcome him. And now Ten's going to try and get down this line. Charlie Morley does well, and he's a foul, I think, on Charlie, but we're going to carry on with advantage. Matt Carter on the ball, Rich Show peeling off. Carter with some control play through the middle. Finds Ricky Evans who's going to tee up a shot on the left foot. It's a good hit and it's a good save from Aaron Reed. And I like that from Ricky. You can see the minute he got the ball, he wanted to shoot Tekkers. Very, very clean strike. Laces. It was, it was rising late. I just think if it was either side of the goalkeeper, the power was there. Yeah, again, promising stuff from Hashtag through the middle. Stampy wins the header. Sends it over to Tom Williams. who's a little bit out of position right now. Him and Jack seem to have... They haven't swapped, have they? No, they're going to swap back now, I think. Yeah, just a bit of a repositioning from those two. They're going to leave it as it is for now. Jack currently in the left-back position. And uh, it's a ball through. Tom Williams gets a touch on it. Jacko comes for it. Oh, and it's a good chance for Wivenhoe, the number nine. Good recovery there from Kane after a header went the wrong way from Jack Harrison. Charlie Morley now regaining the ball. Bit of a hospital pass to Matt Carter, though. A big recovery from Jack Harrison. Had to be good to slide with a yellow card. Three hashtag players on yellows. Both centre-backs on yellows, Techers. Yeah, I think Wivano would be looking to... Good ball that. from Ryan Adams. Richo beats his man. Is it 2-0? It's a massive save. Harry Honesty with the rebound. Puts it straight to the keeper. It's another one-on-one -on -one for Richo not scored. The game is starting to open up. I believe there's going to be another goal. It has to be hashtags. We're starting to get in, get, get in behind. Jacko with the goal kick, which was actually a free kick after a foul on Stampy. Richo using his body very well. It's a great first touch. Looks to find Harry Honesty, who's going to get there before the keeper. Hits it back across. Oh, and he just needed to find Ryan or Couchy. It's unlucky. That final ball again, just missing for hashtag. Tom Williams does well to come and get the ball. Ricky Evans plays it back to Jack Harrison. Jack Harrison takes a touch and finds Tom Williams, who sets Ricky. It's good football here. Going to come to the back stick. Oh, the header into danger for the keeper who comes and catches it. Uh, 1 1 lost two, but we've been trying a lot of new players out. Chance for Wivenhoe. Is that onside? He is. Stampy needs to recover. Number nine goes through. Massive save from Jamie Jackson with the scariest left foot in football. He stops the ball dead. That's a one on one opportunity. A chance for an equaliser. Jacko, we love you. Kane will be introduced back into the game shortly. Corner comes in from Matt Carter. Jack Harris in the back stick wins the header. And it's straight at the keeper. If it had been either side of him, it could have been a second goal for the captain. But the keeper does well. Sends it first time towards the attackers for Wivenhoe. Stampy comes and recovers well after a, uh, a header from Tom Williams. Lino's flagging for a handball there, I think. Yeah, and well, I mean, if that's, he's in the if box. That's, oh, and no. they've given a penalty. Stampy has no one on him. No pressure. The fact that he'd be said to handball it there is... I mean, maybe he did. The fact is we haven't got replays here. The linesman certainly got... Lines person has certainly got a much better view than us. Devs will be fuming about that. It's a Let's see what Jacko can do. I mean, Jacko's had a good game and yep. I've got every faith in him. If Jacko can save this, he will be a hero and the whole city of Hashtag will be going crazy tonight. His number nine's going to take it. It's Miles Pasley, who's been a, a troublesome player for us all game using his body well. Stampy will be fuming about that one. I mean, he didn't need to handball it. Again, you guys have a better idea of it than us. We're at the other end of the pitch right now. If it was a handball or not, vote on the poll. Come on, Jacko. Jacko, put yourself in the hashtag history books for the first penalty saver. Oh, and it's gone the wrong way. And it's a goal for Wivenhoe, and you have to say it's against the run of play. I don't believe they deserve it. And I think 
we're really paying the price for not using the ball in the last third the best way we could. We haven't found our players in the box. That goal kick's gone all the way through here. Jack Harrison has to deal with it. Good first touch from the player. Great recovery from Jack Harrison. Let's go, hashtag. Lee Hurst it. Finds Tom Williams. He's going to send it down the line to Harry Honesty. No, he cuts inside. He's got Lee to his left and uh, Harry to his... Harry to his left, sorry. Comes to Ryan Adams, though. Ryan goes back to Harry. He's going to win this ball. He's going to get there for pace. He's got Richo to aim at in the box. Richo! Oh, it's a massive chance! It's such good play down the left side, starting with Tom Williams, actually starting with a Jack Harrison tackle. Ryan found Harry. Harry whipped it in. Finally, it was put on Neil Richo, Richmond's header, just where he wanted it. Tom Williams going to whip this in. Come on, lads. Get on the end of it. Mark a stamp to be a hero in the box after giving away the penalty. Maybe it would be lovely. Jack Harrison gets a flick. Rich shows at the back stick. Puts it back in towards the back. It's off the bar. Oh, it's off the bar, I mean, guys. Richo cannot buy a goal at the moment. I mean, that was, that was, he's done everything right there. He just looped it over the keeper and he's just come off the bar. Tom's gone short. Yeah, he's going to go short to Tom Williams. Tom's going to whip this in on the left foot. It's not a bad ball. Towards the back stick. There's three of them underneath it. Harry honestly got something on it. Marcus Stamp now trying to hold the ball up. Don't give a foul away, boys. It's going to come back to Lee Hurst. who has to win it. He gets something on it. Harry honestly gets a flick. Richo with the touch. Oh, and it's in. But there's a flag up. There's a flag up. It's not, it's, it went wide. It was, it was wide anyway. It was a side netting. It looked like he'd scored it. Luckily, we'll never know because it was offside anyway. Well, we will know. The cameras show that it didn't go in. Two players to deal with for Tom. It's going to be whipped in on the left foot. It needs to be cleared. It is by Jack. Very, very high. Someone clear. Jack needs to win the second one. He doesn't, but it comes to Ricky who gets something on it. Here's Aaron Couch. Couch sends it long towards Richo. And the ref's blown up for full time. And that's a really disappointing one. It's a draw. It's another point in the league. But it feels like two points dropped because we were so close to getting the win. It means they're going to stay around that kind of bottom half of the table. Uh, Tekkers, how did you find that one? Yeah, I think we, we dominated for, for the most part. Attacking, we, we, we did create more chances today. Uh, we got into the final third. The final ball might have been better. Um, it was an open game, but we'll be disappointed with that, definitely. It ends one all, and we'll see what Devs have to say after that one. You've been brilliant. You've been brilliant, Dave. You've been really good. I can't complain about that performance. But it's that sucker blow again. We've got to be more clinical. We've got to take our chances when we've got them. A bit more composure, I think. Maybe even a little bit more desire. Performance-wise, it's, it's been terrific. I, I'm, I'm getting ready to come off and say to you, one nil, on best result in football almost. One nil, because you've just you've done enough, you've kept, you've shut them out, and it's as comfortable, <laughs> it's as comfortable as a one nil you're gonna see. That's that's what I'm getting ready to say. Their reaction tells you everything. And I understand it. I've got no problem with it at all. It's gonna come, be angry at yourselves, be angry with each other, right, in here, in here, and in here only. Don't feel sorry for yourselves, we don't do that. Right, we're not going to feel sorry for ourselves. But we've got to work hard and keep working hard and keep working hard and it, and, and it will happen. If you take the goals away and someone just said, says, look, watch the performance, but I'm going to cut all the goals out, people are going to think you've just you've murdered them. And you have. But sometimes it's not enough. But we will be winning and we will, we will win. And we will have a good season. I promise you. But you've got to stay tight because it's almost this is what we're up against now. We're up against, people want us to, they want us to fail. You can see it, it's building, they want us to foul. A lot of people watching want us to foul. I'd rather be in here today than be in there. I'd rather be in here today than be in there. Because if I'm sitting there celebrating that, I know I'm in trouble. Well done. Let's have a shower. Cool down, boys, all together. Boys, those who can, come on, we cool down. So I'm here with Jack Harrison, the captain. How's that for you? Uh, I think everyone's come off very disappointed today. Um, obviously, they've had a couple of chances, but nothing I mean, nothing as clear-cut as the penalty they got. But the win will come soon. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed, especially if I keep my goal-scoring boots on. Um, no, I think, yeah, we, we created a load of chances today. We just haven't put the ball in the net. I think, yeah, a lot of them have been with our head as well. It just seems that nothing is falling for us and, every, yeah. Everything sort of seems to be going over the bar, or a lot of them I've fallen onto my knees on the floor. It's like that's got to go in, but no, it's, um, fingers crossed it's going to come soon. And talk to me a little bit more in depth about your goal. Uh, well, you know, 
it was a cut across the foot with my left outside, I, outside the boot I mean to be honest I was just trying to get it on target and I think the keeper probably was quite unsighted because it was from memory it was coming out of the pack but um, yeah I'll, I'll say the keeper was unsighted rather than it was a screamer I mean they usually go out for a corner but it's quite good for you exactly. well they, that's why I don't normally shoot but yeah today obviously it's worked so yeah especially after missing a couple of games very disappointed to come back in and uh, yeah, not get the three points in the first first game with the captain's armband on. And yes, guys, that is going to be the end of the video. I hope you have enjoyed it. I'm here on the pitch with Lee Hurst doing, doing his warm down. And Mr. Wes Tanser currently warming down his fingers on his phone and hashtagging it at the same time. But yeah, as you've heard from Debs and Jack Harrison, it's, uh, it's not nice. I mean, coming away with a draw on paper is not too bad, but against a team like that, we... We would have quite liked to have a win, but I'm not going to bore you guys too much. Next week, we have Braintree Town, Town Reserves. And is that away? It's an away game. An away yes. game. I'm looking forward to it. But as always, if you've enjoyed the video, be sure to drop it a like. Subscribe if you're new and click, click the notification bell. And as always, don't forget to hashtag it. Oh,